Crypto Lightsaber back with another video and I want to talk about a project that I'm, um, you know, looking forward to uh, coming on the 1st of September. It's Crypto Zoo and this is actually the brainchild of Logan Paul. Uh, Logan Paul, um, some of you might have actually watched his brother in a boxing match last night. I was up late watching that um, against a UFC fighter. Um, but yeah, these guys are very famous. Of course, if you're watching this, you probably know who Logan Paul is and Jake Paul anyway. Okay, but Logan Paul is a huge fan of NFTs and he's always been a huge fan of Pokemon. So the fact that he's launched this project um, is what has got me interested. Okay, now normally when celebrities talk about projects or they, they start shilling cryptos, but I don't really take much notice, okay, because their user base, their audience, is, they have large audiences like Logan Paul. Uh, let's just go on YouTube actually and see exactly how much of an audience Logan Paul has, okay, but a lot of these guys have massive followings, but their followings are not necessarily people in the crypto space. So they have a lot of influence in terms of influencing people towards crypto, which is good for the space overall. But he has 23.2 million um, subscribers on this channel and he's got a few channels like Impulsive. He's got a few channels and he's got basically loads of subscribers, millions of subscribers across these channels, right? But I don't normally take notice because, you know, their influence, yes, they have a big influence, but a lot of those people have still not been onboarded onto crypto. So I don't pay too much attention. But with Logan Paul on this project, the fact that um, he has a very massive uh, interest in Pokemon. I know he's a super Pokemon fan. Um, he collects uh, Pokemon cards and all that sort of stuff. He's been doing it for years. He's like a little kid when it comes to this sort of stuff. Right. So the fact that he's got a genuine interest in it, that's what attracts me to this token. Okay. So Crypto Zoo is an NFT project. Now, I, I never get a chance to get in early on these NFT projects. I actually own some NFTs, but the ones that I own are not really the popular ones, so they're not really worth much. Okay. Now, with this one, you're going to be able to own NFTs, and it is actually a token. And we'll look a little bit more about the NFT, but just very quickly, the token is on PancakeSwap. And it's called Crypto Zoo, of course, Zoo. All right, guys. But there are a few Zoo tokens. If you type Zoo on Pancake Swap, you're going to get a few options that come up. Okay. Now you need to make sure that you uh, you put in the correct um, the correct contract in, and the contract is on the website, which is CryptoZoo.co, CryptoZoo.co, and the contract is right here. So you know it's the one that ends in FE nine nine seven, and that is the chart. Now. Rest assured, uh, there's no point in trying to rush into this at the moment because the trading has halted for this temporarily. Um, so it should be available again um, uh, during um, the next 24 to 36 hours, maybe something like that. OK, because right now we're on August the 30th and this is launching on August, uh, sorry, September the 1st. And with this, if you use the Zoo token, uh, you get a 10% discount on the base egg pre-sale or the base egg, the NFTs. Uh, so you can mint new eggs, okay? And within those eggs, there's like packs of cards or whatever, which you can uh, you can trade. And it actually, they some of them actually yield you tokens or all of them, I'm not sure, okay? But um, as you can see, the trading has halted on the PooCoin chart. So don't try and trade it on PancakeSwap at the moment because you won't be able to buy it in. Once this does get re uh, reopened again, I reckon that we're going to get a bit of a surge. And it's actually gone absolutely crazy already. This token has not just launched. In fact, the token's been on PancakeSwap since the 12th of June, or at least we've got PooCoin chart history from the 12th of June. Okay, and if we just go from the bottom of the previous swing to the local top, 4,000%, all right, so it's done a lot already, but it's very cheap, okay, it's very cheap, um, sitting at 0 0.00044 of a cent, okay, the market cap on here is about 863 million, of course, he's got a massive following, he's got, uh, I think there's about 8,000 holders on this token, and there's a lot of liquidity in there, so it's by no means not a rug pull or anything like that, but I think that this token has definitely good utility, <clears throat> So if you look at some of the tokens or some of these sneak peeks that they've given you on the Twitter, which has 10.9 followers, 10.9k uh, followers, by the way, and by the way, the Telegram has loads, 20.251, 20,000 followers on Telegram. All right, I'm going to leave all the links in the description as I normally do. Okay, guys, but the NFTs, you get these rare creatures, all right? And they have utility. So let's say, for example, this one, it looks like a flower to me, but this one is a 
the, and the ape fly. And the rarity of this is super rare, but this actually yields you 18,000 zoo tokens. And I believe that's on a daily basis, potentially. Okay, another example. We have, um, not this one. So this is a cross between an elephant and a panda. As you can see, that panda looks like an elephant. And the elephant has like a panda's face. All right, guys. But um, they've covered up uh, this one in the middle. Okay, but another example right here is all... Well, it says, ever wondered what would happen if you bred an elephant with a panda? And you get the panda fan. Okay, so these are made up creatures. All right, guys, people are really excited about this one. There was another example. So you've got here the lion kitten. Okay, so it's a lion and a kitten mixed together. This, the rarity of this is super rare. This also yields you 18,000 zoo tokens a day. And remember, this hasn't gone live yet. This is going live in September the 1st, all right? I'll just give you one more example while we're on the subject because I really like this one and I would like to get my hands on this one. But this one's super rare and it's basically the penguin shark that also yields you 18,000 zoo tokens daily. So you can see that it is daily, right? So this is the penguin shark and I really like this, okay? Um, you've got pudgy penguins, you've got uh, Doge Pound, you've got all these sorts of NFTs that people are going crazy for. This one for me is super different and it's got utility, it's yielding your tokens, there's a reason to hold it. Uh, these are going to be worth a lot in my opinion, none of this is financial advice but I think it's going to increase in price. I think the base price for these, these NFTs will start about $300. To mint them but of course you get a 10 percent discount if you use the zoo token but you can also buy this with ethereum as well okay so it's on the binance smart chain it's cross chain binance smart chain and erc20 you can buy the nfts on september the first um using ethereum so you can mint uh, you can mint eggs there's going to be ten thousand eggs so you can mint those with ethereum and you can also mint them using the zoo token i'm actually waiting to buy some of the zoo token because i don't actually own any at the moment like i said i always get these projects pretty late guys and guys let me know in the comments of any new projects because guys i'm sick of being late to the party on these projects all right so I would have liked to have known about the zoo token while it was way down there But of course, I'm gonna have to buy it up here And the only reason that I'm going to be buying it up here is for the simple fact that I just want some NFTs I want some of these NFTs. I want them in my wallet I want to be able to trade them on OpenSea or whatever because you know people are making hundreds of thousands Some people even millions on NFTs just by getting in early All right guys and a lot of people still don't know about this I know it's got a massive community with 20,000 in the telegram 10,000 on Twitter But there's still a lot of people that don't know about this and there are a few videos on YouTube that you can go and watch All right guys, there's a few videos you can go and check out and um, you'll be able to know a little bit more about this. But there's a video also, I'm gonna leave a link to this article for the BSC Times. There's a video of Logan Paul talking about the NFT, talking about the project where, where he announced that it was gonna be going live on September the 1st. And he's super excited about this, guys. All right, guys, is I think he's actually friends with Gary V. And if any of you know about V friends, I mean, these guys know about uh, art, they know about crypto, they know about NFTs, they know they have an influence, you know, I think that this one could do really well. All right, guys, so I hope I've explained it uh, the best that I can. And you guys have got enough information to make your own informed decision on this on this token or on these NFTs. But I think that these are going to be very big. And I'm hoping that I can get my hands on a few NFTs. So I'm going to be watching like a hawk. I've actually had this web page open for a couple of days because a lot of times I forget about these projects. And I don't want to forget about this one. I'm going to be watching like a hawk on September the 1st so that I can actually get my hands on some of these eggs. Oh, oh and by the way, you can actually buy the eggs and I think you don't have to hatch them. But you won't know what you're getting until you hatch them. You won't know what uh, animals you have. But you want to get your hands on some super rare animals. They're going to yield you tokens while you're holding it. And they're going to increase in value. So you're going to potentially be able to sell those for thousands. Thousands, some even hundreds of thousands potentially in the future. If you just hold on to them. Okay, so I know that Logan Paul, according to this, has invested a lot of money into this token and they're out of pocket on this token, but they really want it to work. And I know that he's got a passion for it. So for the simple fact that I know he has a passion for Pokemon and NFTs, I know that he's going to take this very seriously. And, you know, one thing I will say about this guy and his brother, they have a passion, they have a drive. They seem to perform well in a lot of the things that they do. There's something about them that makes them successful. And, you know, not everyone can make it in on YouTube. Not 
everyone can make it uh, selling clothes or doing the things that they do and creating a presence and a brand like they've created. But the Logan uh, Paul or the Paul brand is definitely something that's making waves right now. His brother Jake Paul is probably one of the most talked about things in boxing at the moment, although he's only had about five fights. So, I mean, yeah, these guys definitely have something about them and they definitely know how to make money. They know how to uh, uh, create a brand, okay? So who knows, CryptoZoo might be the biggest crypto brand that we see in this space after uh, the, the, what's it called, the, the crypto punk or, or whatever it's called, the, the, the punk one that Visa just bought. All right, guys. So yeah, let me know in the comments what you think about this token. Let me know in the comments if you know about any projects or any hot NFTs because I want to know about these NFTs. I don't want to miss out on this NFT craze. I want to make some money just like we all do and I want to collect some cool art at the same time. All right, guys. So like, comment and subscribe. I'll see you in the next video.